Hi there, welcome to the Auburn State Rec area. My name is Justin. Today I'm going to take you on the Quarry Trail hike. Let's go! The Auburn State Rec area is home to hundreds of miles of hiking trails, providing spectacular views of the American River Canyon to visitors. It's no wonder visitors come flooding from all over year round to explore these historic trails, such as the popular Quarry Trail. So some reasons why the Quarry Trail hike in the Auburn State Recreation Area is so popular amongst visitors is due to the hike being a nice, flat, easy trail that visitors can hike upon with their friends and family, while the trail is also wheelchair accessible, so for those with a disability, they can definitely do this trail with ease. Along this trail is the Middle Fork of the American River, where visitors get to gaze upon the river flowing downstream, later to converge with the North Fork of the American River at the confluence. As for recreational opportunities on the Quarry Trail, visitors enjoy hiking, mountain biking, horseback riding, and kayaking or inner tubing downstream in the summer. Like I mentioned earlier, the Quarry Trail runs right along the Middle Fork of the American River. This water flows down to meet at the confluence with the North Fork of the American River, where they converge into one river, the North Fork, which later flows down into Folsom Lake which provides drinking water for Sacramento County and Placer County. So if you're, you're wondering where you get your drinking water from, this is one of the rivers that you get your drinking water from. The Middle Fork of the American River tends to be a lot colder than the North Fork. This reason is because the Middle Fork of the American River comes strictly from snow melt from the Sierra Nevada, whereas the North Fork comes strictly from Mountain Meadow Lake and the Tahoe National Forest, where it has time to sit before it converges at the confluence with the Middle Fork. This 11 mile out and back trail is most popular during the fall and springtime when temperatures are around the mid 70s. As for wildlife at the park, as you can hear soaring above head are many of the different species of eagles and hawks throughout the Auburn State Rec area. Other wildlife at the park also include black-tailed deer, raccoons, gray foxes, coyotes, rattlesnakes, mountain lions, and black bears have also been seen throughout the park. The Auburn State Rec area is truly one of a kind in the beauty and historical value that it provides to its visitors. As you can see, there are a variety of picnic areas for visitors to rest and enjoy the park's beauty. Scattered amongst the trail, visitors will come across old mining remnants that were constructed from the gold rush in the early 1850s. Many children get very excited when they first see these old structures, often mistaking them for castles or battle forts. Visitors who desire to get their adrenaline pumping hike up the two switchback trail to the quarry section of the trail. Visitors are often blown away by the size and beauty of the enormous limestone quarry. People always describe the quarry as looking just like a scene from a movie like Jurassic Park. You can see exactly what they mean by the moss covered rock faces of the quarry. As you can see in the bottom left of your screen, many visitors enjoy to rock climb the differing difficulties of rock faces here at the quarry. The main natural resource that comes from the quarry is limestone. Limestone has a variety of different uses for everyone. Many historic structures were actually built from limestone. Today, limestone is one of the materials used in cement, and other uses include the manufacturing of pharmaceuticals, toothpaste, paint, paper, and glass. This quarry is where it all got started as far as the history goes in the start of the quarry trail in the Auburn State Rec area. The quarry trail was constructed due to the gold rush that happened here in California in the 1850s. The quarry trail back then was a road that was used to haul quarry rock back to the main line of Auburn that was further examined for gold. The Mountain Quarry Mine was the largest limestone quarry in Northern California that was powered entirely by PG&E in the early 1900s. Over the years, approximately 9.1 million tons of limestone was excavated and transported to the main crushing plant in Auburn. Also throughout the Auburn State Rec area, you can smell the beautiful flora and fauna that is abundant throughout the entire California State Park. Plant life in the park include ponderosa pines, douglas fir, manzanita, and black oak. In the early spring, wildflowers such as fiddleneck, Indian paintbrush, larkspur, and lupine bloom over the acres of land. We highly encourage visitors to feel and smell the awesome plant life here in the Auburn State Rec area. The Auburn State Rec area welcomes over 900,000 visitors per year throughout the 42,000 acres of land stretching more than 40 miles along the north and middle forks of the American River. Also a fun fact about the Auburn State Rec area is that in the 2002 film Triple X, actor Vin Diesel is seen driving a red Corvette off the top of the Four Sill Bridge, which is the fourth tallest bridge in North America, and proceeds to parachute down to the bottom of the American River Canyon. Not too many other California state parks can say that about their park. The Auburn State Rec area provides a little something for everyone. It's a place to recreate, explore, 
learn more about California's extraordinary history, or just a place to relax during one's leisure time. We hope you learned something new about our beautiful and diverse California State Park and enjoyed your time hiking the Cory Trail. Thanks again for hiking the Cory Trail hike in the Auburn State Rec area. We hope to see you again soon.